Hi folks, welcome to another Wednesday widget. Jared is gonna walk you through how he made this plate. This is pretty easy machining, but it's also pretty easy to screw up because this is about 16 by nine and a half by 3 16 thick. We're gonna use the new vacuum fixture plate. Let's rock and roll. So we're here at the Torchmate. We're uh, getting ready to cut some 190 aluminum. Great surface finish, great surface finish. Better than uh, your uh, extruded stuff. So let's go ahead and hit cycle start. We haven't cut much aluminum with this uh, torch mate very much but we were impressed the first time we uh, used it. Surface finish is absolutely amazing. Cuts beautifully. So let's go ahead and head on over to the bridge port so we can square this thing up. As you can see, I have a bunch of one, two, three blocks stacked up here. I already knocked off all the dross off the piece of aluminum. There wasn't much. Uh, so let's get started. All right, folks, now that we are done with the CNC portion of it, here comes the fun part. We gotta drill all uh, six holes in the side of this thing, on each side, here and here. So we're gonna have to rig it up in the bridge port, see if we can get her did.
and we're done. Got a good, pretty good looking part here. Um, the Bridgeport stuff, you know, uh, it makes me appreciate using CNC. Um, but other than that, it, it, it turned out real nice. Hope you enjoyed, folks. We're not actually done with this because one of the customer specifications was no tooling marks on this visible part here. So if you want to see how we get rid of those, click subscribe. We'll be, we'll be back with a video on how we do that. Otherwise, appreciate you guys commenting below, giving the video a thumbs up. Take care. See you next Wednesday.